Hi, I'm Mike from BlindsOnline.com, and I'm here to show you how to measure for vertical blinds. Uh, vertical blinds can be mounted two ways, either inside the window casing or outside the window casing. If you're going to mount your vertical blinds inside the window casing, that is, inside the frame of the window, you're going to require a minimum of three inches of window depth. Okay, this window happens to have five inches of depth, which is more than enough to accommodate a vertical blind inside the window frame. If you have three inches or less in depth, you will have to mount your blinds on the outside of the casing. First, let's, let me show you how we're going to measure for an inside mount. We've measured our mounting depth, and we've determined that we have at least three inches in this case. So we've decided to mount the vertical blind inside the frame. We're going to ask you for three width measurements. We're going to ask you to measure the width of the top of the window frame. I'd like you to measure the width in the center of the window. And also, I'd like you to measure the width of the bottom of the window frame. We're going to ask that you provide us with the smallest of those three measurements rounded down to the nearest one eighth of an inch. Now, for the height, I'd like you to also take three measurements. We'd like you to measure the far left side of the window. I'd like you to measure from the center of the window. And I'd like you to measure from the far right down to the sill. Now, in this case, we'd like you to provide us with the shortest of those three measurements, keeping in mind that we will make a slight deduction from that measurement so that the vertical louvers will hang just high enough above the sill that they don't rub on the window sill. So vertical blinds get measured a little bit differently than our other products, so it's important to note that these measurements are specifically for vertical blinds. Now let's say you don't have enough window depth. Uh, your window isn't deep enough. It doesn't have at least three inches of window depth. Well, you'll, in that case, you will have to mount your vertical blinds on the outside of the window frame. Now in order to measure for an outside mount vertical blind, we're going to ask you to measure from left side of window casing to right side of window casing. And typically we'll add six inches to that measurement. Now, here we have 42 inches. I'm going to add six to that measurement for a total of 48. That's going to give us an overlap of three inches on each side. Now, in this particular case, it's not going to work out because we have a fireplace mantle in the way. Okay. If, if we didn't have the fireplace mantle, then the three inches on each side would be just right. However, in this case, we don't have the option to go three inches on the left side. So we're going to go as far left as we possibly can go with the tape measure. And we're going to bring our tape measure over on the right, three inches past the window casing. So in this particular case, we're going to get a measurement of 46 inches in width. Again, this is a little bit different than the ordinary window frame, but you, will, you may run into a situation like this, so I thought it would be important that you know how to measure in this particular case. Now that we have our width measurement, we would like you to provide us with the height measurement. Now the height measurement is typically taken from the top of the window trim down to where you'd like the blinds to hang. Now some folks um, like the blinds to stop at the windowsill if there were a windowsill. In this case there is no windowsill, so we're going to bring the blinds down just an inch or two below the bottom molding. I think it looks, looks best when we just come down below the bottom molding a couple of inches. So here we have a measurement of 56 inches. Now to that measurement we're going to add an additional two inches, and now those two inches are going to be the bracket height that's going to be mounted above the window trim. Okay? I prefer not mounting to the window casing for vertical blinds. I always prefer mounting above the window casing. So we're going to take that height measurement, which is going to be from the top of the trim to wherever it is you would like those blinds to hang. Now you can, you can have those blinds hang anywhere you'd like as long as you remember to add those additional two inches to the height for the bracket that's going to be mounted above the window casing. Okay, so once you have supplied, you have your width measurement and your height measurement, you have everything you need to order your vertical blinds. Mike from BlindsOnline.com.